Good evening, I'm Holden Absher. After a dip in COVID-19 rates earlier in the fall, IU health officials report seeing increases across the state. In August, Monroe County recorded an average number of under 30.8 cases per day. In November, Monroe County recorded an average number of under 31.1 cases per day. The first two days of December, the average in the county was 81. IU Health Bloomington completed its move to the new Regional Academic Health Center Sunday, leaving its old site vacant. It leaves behind 24 to 25 acres of land that in that is a, a huge redevelopment opportunity for the city and will effectively create a brand new uh, you know, neighborhood. The city of Bloomington purchased the old hospital site on West 2nd Street in 2018 and plans to develop the area into housing, green spaces, and other uses. Crowley says a lot of the work will take place now that the move is done. Indiana quarterback Michael Penix Jr. announced Monday he has entered the transfer portal, effectively ending his IU career. In 2020, he threw 14 touchdowns and was named second team All Big Ten. But that same season, like all four Penix played at IU, was cut short by injury. He never played more than six games in a season. Indiana had a 12 and five record in Penix's 17 career starts. And now for a look at the weather tonight, partly cloudy with a low of 20 degrees. The five day forecast, mostly cloudy on Tuesday, sun on Wednesday, 60% chance of showers on Friday, and an 80% chance of showers on Saturday. For more local news, go to WTIUNews.org and catch Indiana News Desk Fridays at 6 p.m. Have a good night.